Do you know which family? Like, which tent is there? Start of summer and happen, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, don't really recall. A lot of people here sort of keep to themselves. <laughs> well, he just points over with his knife that he's cleaning these boots with <laughs> over to this side. Uh, this blue one here? I keep to themselves. We kind of keep to ourselves. Look after our own. Not enough compassion to go around for everyone, unfortunately. Doesn't have to be that wife alone. Alright. People are just moving. Everyone's a little scared, a little on edge. You resort to trust in the people you know. I think one just place to a proper community. That'll change quick. Precisely. Yeah, it's still better than what we had. And what was that? Hmm. I suppose y'all aren't from around here. Well, better. Are you from the Brigands? Mm-hmm. Brigandale. Brigandale. Oh, yeah. Live just like this. They would never let our kind inside the walls. Our kind? Huh. Only the esteemed individuals got nice places. The rest of us lived in the valley. Most people still go by valley folk, even though huh, moved up a little bit. Right. So was there anything uh, um, the gotcha. <laughs> strange happening in Brigandale before everybody moved here? Hmm. Well. No, that's not to say. You can trust me, I'm a Kafar. Oh. oh. Bless you, sister. Pray for us. I will. Know the Sanghelia is with you. Oh, I wouldn't have lived to this age if they weren't. He takes the other boot and begins cleaning it. Looking around now, uh, is anyone poking their head out of their tent? You do see that there are... Some of the wagons have windows that are sort of being looked out of. Other people are just sort of minding their business in front of their uh, assorted facilities. Um, but there is definitely no kid in sight here. I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. And uh, whereabouts did he indicate the uh, people that had their child taken? This way. There, there's probably about six or seven rows of these places. He said <laughs> somewhere off that way. Right, just in that direction. Please, if you know something, anything at all, it could be helpful. And see that the Sanghelia's will is done here. Mm. I feel for you, sister. I do. Truly. But I didn't live to this age by running my mouth. What was the, the question that Cleo once answered? What happened? If anything Cleo? strange was happening in Brigandsdale before the move. Ah. It's best to let old rumors die where they Were they about the mayor? He just goes back to working. Well, I'm almost done with this one. Can I gauge if he reacted when I said that? Sure, absolutely. He seems to want no part of that conversation. <laughs> Regardless of if you're accurate or not, he's just like, nope, nope, nope. Yeah, yeah he doesn't want to be linked to any sort of slander against a mayor of a town. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Makes sense, considering the mayor is also very ostentatious with his punishments, it seems. Uh, who was the mayor of Brigandale? Anyway. Another lord, uh, I assume. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, what was his name? Nice gentleman, Maxwell something or other. Lord Maxwell. Mm. Not sure if that was family name or surname. That was his last name? Can I insight to see if he's lying to give us a fake lead? Yeah. Absolutely. I'd like to join yeah. you. <laughs> I'll, I'll assist you. Don't you don't take advantage. You don't need advantage. You're fine. Let's just see how bad I nice. do. 32. <laughs> I gaze yeah. into this man's soul. <laughs> Absolutely. You, you've you heard this type of thing when people are giving down decrees and orders. They say in the name of so-and-so, in this case, Lord Maxwell, this is what's happening. You get the feeling that this man, that's probably about all he's ever heard of that guy. <laughs> okay. Decrees and demands. Yeah. Well, I appreciate your help all the same. Oh, it's no trouble. Just finished up here. Three copper, sir. Oh, all I got silver. You, you can have it. That's Benjamin in one place. I I put ten gold on the table for him. My Christ, brother, Christ! You're about to destroy their economy. Actually, chill. For your family, you understand. Oh, bless you, sister. Bless you. <laughs> I, hmm. my granddaughter, Melissa. She's been having a tooth that's been bothering her. I don't know if you can check that out. Um, I'll stop in on the way out before we leave. Before we leave town. How about that? My, bless you, sister. Bless you. Would it, would it cure wounds? Heal a, <laughs> a, a rotted tooth? <laughs> no, it'd be like lesser restoration. Uh, regeneration. <laughs> but it's also... More importantly, a connection to a kid who might have known the disappearing kid. Hmm. Oh, that's true. Uh, how yeah, how old is your granddaughter? Sleeping. Oh, she's seven now. Good, good, polite, kind young lady. I guess I could check on that now. Oh, of course, of course. Let me go get her. Unless any else of you want your shoes taken care of? Uh, I'll probably get to Mucky again. I'll stop by when we're actually going to be resting for the night. <laughs> uh, of course, sir, of course. He heads inside for a minute into this tent. Probably just shakes his head like, no, he's fucking not at this point. <laughs> hey, you don't don't knock it. I'm looking clean. Yeah, you, you look how, nice, good is it, how good is this shoe clean? How good is this shoe? Pretty nice. Good <laughs> shoes. Okay. <laughs> you know what? I don't know. I don't get my boots clean the same reason I don't make my bed in the morning. I'm just going to muss it up again. I'm just going to step over here. I'm going to stay out the dirt. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I think he's walking on his heels right now. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to go like over here, then find like the smallest patch of grass, hop across over there. Uh, he's going to start calling himself Lord Lucky now. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you curse me? He's clearly a dude. You know, you'd never you those shoes again if you walked on your hands all everywhere he just holds out these really ornate magical looking gauntlets of his get these dirty no way <laughs> what do those do what do they, what do those do what are they what are those <laughs> like what i tell you what do i know what those are <laughs> uh these are new from the last time you met him Fuck. Okay. they're called Gauntlets of Supremacy. That sounds a bit uh pretentious. pretentious. Oh, you bet it is. <laughs> 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 After <laughs> plus one AC. Ah, <laughs> uh, they're actually way better than that. <laughs> yeah, I figured as much. God damn it! So loot his body when he dies. Okay, okay. <laughs> there, there might be his like graduation thing. After a few minutes, he opens the door. Please, come in. Come in. 
I'll head inside. You see him throw out this small little carpet for you to wipe your feet on. I wipe my feet to not be rude. Absolutely. I wipe my course, feet as best course. I can. As you enter along this tent and then this um, wagon that it's attached to, you see several people in there. A younger man, probably th- mid-30s, with uh, a woman around the same age. They're all dressed in this similar loose flowing garments that are layered on top of them, but they don't have the headpiece as they're not outside. But you do see a young girl with uh, curly black hair walking forward. Hi, you're Alyssa, right? Yeah. I hear your tooth's been bothering you. She does a little shake of her head. Okay, I think I can fix that. Um, Shaking your head no or yes? Yes. Okay. Oh, so she's nodding. Oh, right, yeah, nod, shake. God dang it. (laughs) Oh, um... I I have to um, touch you to use my magic, okay? And I'll try and cast uh, Lesser Restoration. Okay, you look at her gum and you see that there's an abscess over it. Do I know if Lesser Restoration will take care of that? Yeah. Okay. As you cast the spell on the tooth, you pull out some of this infection that sits in your hand. Uh, Jericho, will you, like, uh, here, I'll hand it to you. <laughs> <laughs> what? what do you want me to do with this? Also, you didn't use this call sign. Oh, crap. <laughs> What are you talking about? She totally did. Said Scarecrow. Yeah, I said Scarecrow. Um, Alyssa, Riddle did you um, happen to see anything strange a few weeks ago? She when just you were like with the other kids looks over to what it's probably her mom and dad. Um, not really. Or any of the other kids, like being weird or anything um are you done ma'am i don't mean to rush you but we were in the middle of something i won't be much longer um she'll look back at the others like is there anything else i should ask her while we're in here whoops i muted myself um i think jericho uh kind of crossing his arms just kind of uh gets close enough to whisper to uh, Seraph. Uh, I don't think the kid's going to answer anything without the parents say so. You should probably ask them. Might be a um, if your daughter knows anything, it could really help us with our investigation to make sure nobody else goes missing. I'm sorry, we're not interested in that. Uh, are you the father, sir, of this mm. lovely child? Correct. Lorenzo. Uh, he'll, uh, <clears throat> take a step forward and, and put his hand out. The one that wasn't holding the goddamn, uh, Dude. abscess dunk. <laughs> uh, uh, you may call me Scarecrow. We don't use our proper names in the field, uh, so apologies. Uh, right. Take his hand. <laughs> He looks at it and tentatively grabs it. Just a, a single shake. Uh, do you know why we're here? Not in your lovely home, but in... He town. sort of like steps forward to talk to you. You see the mother ushers Alyssa back over to her and they make themselves sort of wallflowers. Yeah, give, give her a nod. Like, ma'am? I'm not exactly sure, but I'm guessing you're worried about what's been happening. Indeed, Lorenzo. People are going missing. Children are going missing. We want to find whatever is behind this and stop it before it takes another. Do you think you could direct us 
towards any of the parents of these children. Your, uh, your father, your father-in-law, I take it. Is it possible that you know anything, or that your daughter does? Like any anything strange the past we few don't, weeks? We don't know anything. Your the the, the shoe shine is he your father? Is he your your wife's father? Father-in-law. Father-in-law. Uh, he had indicated uh, across the way that um, uh, a couple had their uh, the child go missing. Do you know? Who that might have been. He just sort of, uh, Let me walk you out. Of course. As he gets to the door, he just leans close. Last row. That's where they came from. Last row. Thank you very much, sir. I will pray for you and your family. I will as well. We appreciate it. As he ushers you out, you see them close the tent and you hear a latch on the wagon lock behind you. Nice bloke. Lovely family. <laughs> Lucky. Good call. It's like he's still there. They locked him in. <laughs> help! 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 help. <laughs> I think Lucky napped. <laughs> yeah, the the wagon just starts the dungeon I'm somehow. <laughs> he uh, just like gingerly jumps over to this grass patch. <laughs> you want the fucking piggyback ride at this point? Uh, uh, no, I'm not a child. Don't be ridiculous. Wanted to change your course on the princess, huh? He, put, he puts his hands on his uh, his knees to like uh, look at him like he's a kid. Don't do I I I, I could put you on janitor work with Janny. I could do that. <laughs> no. I'll abuse my power. I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll power trip it, man. <laughs> I'll, I'll report you. You know, I did see a lot of uh, spider webs, cobwebs up there in the nooks and crannies of the ceiling. So maybe I should be on janitor duty. Not a lot of people can get those. Uh, anyway, something's last row. weird with these people, right? Yeah. Right. I mean... At first it comes off as they just don't want to get involved, so they aren't a target. But... I don't I'm know. not... It still seems like they'd be anything. willing to talk more, a little bit, at least. Right. Like, surely they have to be worried about their kids, right? Yeah. Did they not ways. seem that worried about their own kid back in there? They see, I mean, they seem protective, but you would figure if there were kids missing and they have kids, they would want that solved. Yeah. Yeah. The way I figured it there is they just didn't want to expose their little, what was it, Alyssa? Alyssa? Alyssa. Yeah. To what's been going on. Didn't want to scare her out of her gourd. But. That makes sense. If you're picking up right. something else, then... Kids Big talk. Kids. I mean, if mm. one of them knows about what's happening, they'll spread it around, so... Right. They could also think one of that the... it's a condition with uh, higher-up authorities. And if they talk about it, then higher-up authorities show up and make their lives even worse. Yeah. Maybe That's what wrong. we need to do. We need to find one of these kids and isolate them. <laughs> and mm. Bully them if we have to. Why do you immediately go to bullying? Are you serious? They're kids. <laughs> because That's he's a bully. Okay. You know, how about this? And he claps his hands together and makes good berries and makes some, like, really sweet looking berries. Oh, you want to like, give him oh. candy? No, you, thanks, you, wanna, you, wanna, you wanna isolate a kid with candy? <laughs> no, no, no I'm... Give candy. You were the one saying oh, stick and oh, carrot oh, earlier. This oh, is carrot. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> he, no, she's got a point. <laughs> Bre Bradford's giving them bears. candy. Fucking, uh, not not Bradford. God damn it! Sarah is giving them candy. Sarah's touching them. You're so and fucking. And you want to bully them, Lieutenant? Lieutenant bully. P bullying is underrated. It <laughs> works. I've seen it. Regardless, uh, the couple, mother, who knows, uh, that had their child taken is in that last row over there. One of those. Right. American. If anyone's going to be helpful, it's going to be someone missing their child. You would think. 
you would think, but I can easily see this going away. We don't like. Oh, my child's already missing. Why would I want to help? I want everyone to hurt the same way I am. Shh. This feels like Let's a show of personal to... place. Let's try not to He's just... it. I mean, hurt just... people hurt people. It's true. You just see Lucky put his hands together in front of his face in a praying motion and mm. do a boy to you. Boy. He's right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's why he's a bully. Is he's hurt and he wants other people to hurt. You are so bitter. How do you even walk around? I don't know. How do you walk around? Oh my god! Fine. Who the fuck With let us in, in my this? step? And nice, well, clean boots. Pep in my step. <laughs> <laughs> Ugly boot looking ass. <laughs> I, I I kick mud on his boots. Oh. Foul. Acrobatics check. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 actually. <laughs> Dodge that shit. If he gets a one, it's gonna be hilarious. <laughs> oh, he rolled so bad. That's... Oh, shit. Oh, oh wait, no, that's you. Oh, okay, yeah. He just turns into like a standing, spinning backflip. Nice try. Oh, shit. Lands in some mud. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's gotta sting. Self fulfilling prophecy. This sucks. Let's go. <laughs> Pretty destined. All is right in the world. Oh, he probably still would have told you. As you head over to the far row, you see people have this similar wave like motion of clearing the path for you, where everyone begins to get more and more scarce. Mm -hmm. As you hear ding, ding, uh. ding. Shit. Um, we should get to the docks, the markets, and the mayors, since that means something's going on, right? No, that means to get inside. It's their curfew bell. Right. Well, it's a possibility. Oh, <sighs> <sighs> else's has. What do you think, Lefty? Should we uh, still continue trying to talk to this person, use their house as cover for the time being? We can just read our shot. Did we uh, hear from the guard that they ding the bell three times when there's trouble or when it's curfew? When it's time to get inside. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. They, they found times when it's more likely they think that something's going to go down, wrong. So just like get inside before that to try okay. and prevent stuff. All right. Go over there. See if we can talk to them. If they're not answering, we'll just stake out. See if we find anything. Right. Uh, now it's a uh, it's a wagon that we're approaching right now, right? So correct. Lock on. Yeah, they're they're similar. They're wagons that have tents off to the side of them to kind of expand the floor plan, if you will. Mm -hmm. uh, did we did we get a name for these these people? You didn't. Did not. Yeah. There's um, a whole row of them, and he just said that last row. It happened mm -hmm. from there. So we don't know which uh, wagon in particular. Correct. Um. I guess Jericho will just start going down the line. Uh, well, one of them as has you, to help. As you knock on the wagon, you see it slightly open, cracking to where you can just see an eyeball poking out the dark. Uh, I think for, for the sake of not scaring these people, he does have his, uh, his bad eye closed this whole time, just so it's not glowing through the fucking mask. Do you have um, something to go over? Oh, wait, no, the, the mask. Never mind. I'll shut up. Go on. Continue. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> uh, so it opens very slightly. Uh, am I able to make out the person inside at all? You see, like an eyeball in half of what appears to be a man's face. Mm -hmm. uh, good eye, sir. Uh, we're investigating the disappearances of children. Do you have the any door slowly closes? <laughs> yeah, right. Next um, one. A kafar. Is there anything I can help you with? Do you hear silence? Well, as we're betray. As the music also went silent. Oh yeah, it's never got put on repeat. Womp, womp. To be fair, this is a good moment for it to be silent. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Hey, hey, hey. So, do y'all go about checking every of the house? Uh, Jericho, Jericho will unless uh, someone stops him. Br uh, Bradford would suggest to Jericho, and I guess to the rest of the group, um, maybe do a little outside the uh, investigation first, see if there's hints of 
Well, a kid not being here anymore. Maybe a toy left out, but the parents didn't pick up. Something like that. Right. You won't try that, I'll keep knocking. Fair enough. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, so why don't y'all roll an esti- investigation while Jericho gets to knocking? Uh, I will assist someone with investigation. I will sure. assist Lucky, because I am very bad at investigation. <laughs> Actually, wait, shit. Okay. It ain't, it ain't a strong suit either. All right. Oh, God. <laughs> well, if you're assisting him, Jericho's doing that. I'll I just roll my itch. own. All right, you know what? It's it's near the end of the day, right? Yeah. Pop yeah. off, King. Hey! That was a really good D8. Holy shit. Hey! 25 and a 24. I forgot I got okay. it to fucking investigation. You come... Oh, I forgot to put the music together. You come across a couple places um, where you see... I don't know if it's gonna start playing again without actually putting it back in. It's okay. I still save the link. You can take like a minute break or two. It's nice. Up there it goes. Wait, does this song start with bells chiming? It does. Oh, that's fun. That's crazy. <laughs> so you do notice and uh, Lucky and Seraph at the same time. There is a section of these wagons that you notice there's like boards placed over the windows. And it's sort of to like the north side of this last row. These last, like, three wagons, they seem to have, like, put extra measures into keeping them safe. Safe or isolated? I guess... Uh, As far as Jericho, you (laughs) don't really get any more responses until you get... About towards the end, right before those, like, three... Okay, let me put it this way. There's one house boarded up. One house not boarded. Two houses boarded up. So in the middle of all these boarded up houses is just a regular house. Correct. Hmm. Okay. You hear someone... They don't open, but they speak to you from the other side of the door. What do you want? Me and my comrades are investigating the disappearances. It is our understanding that a child went missing around here recently. Not recent, no. Right. It's been, what, since the beginning of the warm weather? I've lost track of time, but it's too long. And you're only the second person to come here. 